Hey there, today we're going to discuss a wonderful song called Are You Washed in the Blood? This is on page two of book number three. And this was written by E.A. Hoffman in 1878 and has been performed by many gospel artists over the years, including Johnny Cash, Alan Jackson, Randy Travis, and many more. So let's get into it. Okay, this is another simple one that I uh, play in the key of G. As for the tempo, you're looking at a range of around 105 to 110 beats per minute. And the strum pattern I like to go with is uh, a D, a down, down, up, down. So it's going to be. Uh So it could be uh, something like this. That kind of thing. Like that. Okay, as usual, the intro serves uh, as a great ending for the song when you're done, or at least part of it can be. So look to the intro for an ending. And usually, intros, uh, and I may say this a few different times, are usually the back end of a chorus. So if you're going, are you? Uh, For most songs, I mean, you know, depending on the song, of course, but most of the time you can just take the back end of a chorus and throw it in uh, as an intro. And you can usually end, end up with that. So. Half of it, 
half of the intro will work as an ending. So kind of play with that. Now, if you're looking to add some performance flair, don't forget to incorporate some of your hammer-ons and your pull-offs and some of your easy two-note harmony licks. Just a little bit, just to go along with the bass pattern. It'll bring out, uh, really bring the song to life. So here's a few ideas to get you started. So uh, when I'm doing the intro, he's just basically holding the G chord, and he's holding this this uh, fifth string second fret, but you're hitting holding the G chord. So. And everything's an open string. Two note thing um, we're doing on the second and third string, first and second frets. Moving them up to the third fret with the second uh, string and the third uh, string hitting the third and fourth frets respectively. So. And this lick here is just holding the, the two and then lifting the middle finger up and having them go to the uh, the, the fourth string on the second fret, and then back up to the open G. And if you kind of take, you know, do a little offbeat thing. So I'm going. Um, Since your G with C, C with G in the bass, I use that a lot. Okay. Just real simple. Just keep a good groove going, and uh, you know, down, down, up, down, down. Now go ahead and play along with me on "Are You Washed in the Blood," and uh, add your own personal touch. And we'll see you next Sunday for the next song.